Hey, 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 welcome back to another Let's Talk. This talk is going to be Mama June Family Crisis. Not a rant. Not right now. <laughs> I know y'all enjoy them, but my brain needs a minute. So, this past week's episode focused on our TV niece. She left for college, y'all. She left for Colorado. Her and Draylon driving the little pink machine. I am. Oh, oh well. See, now. I'm glad she left. Meaning, she on her way. You know, granted, the show was aired, you know, last week. But filming was last summer, you know. It's never real time when we see the show. So let's let's get that straight. You know, and because I didn't watch a few other people on YouTube, on Twitter, you know, about what's going on with the Thompson family. Pumpkin, June, Alana, Jessica. And from what's being said on what I'm understanding, and again, this is my opinions, my understandings, and I'm just bringing it to y'all. So I don't want nobody saying, thinking that what I'm saying is actual factual. It's just my opinion. That's it. That's that's all it is in my commentary, you know. So I don't want nobody coming for me. Not that anybody has, I'm just saying. But... From what is being said, that the girls had eventually, you know, moved on from the Coogan accounts. Meaning, they, you know, wasn't mad at her, June, or not as mad at her, but had started moving on. And then they seen what she was saying on the show, because they're watching the show like we're watching it. Because when they do the interviews... You know, where they're sitting on the couch talking to the camera and the producer's on the other side and they're looking at, you know, asking the questions. We can't hear them asking. We just hear the family talking. And so, they're hearing what June was saying. Like, on the car ride back home with Justin and what she had told Justin. Like I said a couple of episodes ago, she had told Justin that she was putting 80% in the Coogan accounts and spending 20%. Uh -uh. No, 33%. If you do somewhat of any type of math, 33% can be broke down two different ways. Where if it's 200 and like, give or take, 250, 280. Yeah, 33%, uh, 20% of that will be $33,000. And 50% will be taxed, be in the taxes, and the 80%, basically, if it was anywhere from, she getting paid from anywhere from like 150 to 260, 270, somewhere in that ballpark. I don't have the numbers in front of me right now to give you the numbers that I had. But, um, 33% will break it down. You know, the 20% will break, the $33,000 will break it down. You know, and, but it still doesn't make sense to me when it comes to, even if that is the 20% and you was keeping your, your cut, which is the 80%, why would you take that from your child? Because you're now getting anywhere from 50 the 70, maybe, possibly, could be $80,000. And you're only giving your child 33000 Let that sink in. And she would have to just deal with it and take it, suck it up. But that's, the she even said pretty, what I'm hearing on the show, Tyler's and Tiara money been gone. Been gone. All that money's gone, which I feel is 
wrong. So yeah, you owe your child some money. You owe your child that money. Because you spent her money. Now, do you owe the full 100%? No. Because you did work, you know, when it came to you on TV getting a check too. And like I heard somebody say, is that you you only getting paid because of who she is, your child. And Pumpkin even said that. If it wasn't for Alana being who she is, none of us, none of them would be on TV. Nobody would know them by name. And at the beginning, when they first started on TV, reality TV, they wasn't making that much money. Like, min barely, you know, under minimum wage type money. You know, like... 10, maybe 15, maybe $20,000 a season. Not an episode, a season. How much does that really go? How far? And I get it, how far does that really go? Could any of us live off 10, maybe $20,000 a year? A year. Let's get that, let's get that sunk in. My car costs more than that. And I'm driving a Chevy. <laughs> so just think. My personal car. My company car is a Mercedes. But my personal car is a Chevy. And it, it costs more than $20,000. All day long. I think things sitting outside in the driveway right now asking me to put some gas in it. Not at these prices. I'm not. You'll sit there in the driveway and look cheap. <laughs> until further notice. Until I feel like going somewhere and then I really have to put gas in it. But that was in the beginning. To 10, 20,000. And she was getting a check. We don't know if she, June was getting a lump sum for herself. Alana Little Alana, you know, here come, you know, Tyler's and Tiara's, and then here comes Honey Boo Boo, both shows. Um, and that's not including what she was winning off of Tyler's and Tiara's. And like I said before, she was winning. Alana was getting it. I don't care what anybody say. You know, you your child ain't got to be thin like this to get it. Alana was thicker than that snicker as a child. And she was getting it on that stage. She was letting her personality shine big. And that's probably why most likely her little self was getting those crowns. Because her personality was just that big. And she was outshining those other little girls. And still can outshine those other little girls. I believe if she went back to pageants, she would still get it. You know, but she's not interested in that no more. That's not her passion no more. Her, her drive no more. She liked at that time to dress up and put on makeup and get her hair done. You know, and be on stage and all eyes on me. At that age, who didn't want all eyes on me? Who didn't think the world revolved around her? Or revolve? I still think the world revolves around me. No. Sometimes I get knocked down in reality and told to snap out of clouds. Hey, it is what it is. But, Tyler said, but she, we really think June was getting checked for herself. Alana, Pumpkin, Jessica at the time, Lauren, which is a.k.a. Pumpkin at the time, Anna at the time, because at the beginning, Anna was in the series, seasons regularly. Her didn't now have a daughter, uh, uh, Anna's daughter, baby, because she had a baby at the beginning of the, all this. Sugar Bear was in the beginning of all this. So, that's eight people total. 
total, he was probably getting a lump sum for it. Then here comes from hot to not. Here comes um, her uh, drug addiction years. Here comes um, all still on TV. Everything's being documented on t uh, documentary on TV. We all can see it come crumbling down around June. Not Alana. You thinking? I would have thought Alana would have had the nut. Cracked up like a nut. Child stars, you know, whatever. You not no not whatever, but whatever when it came to, I would expect it a lot of to fall apart. No, this child and kept it together through all the ups and downs with her mom. And I honestly think without Pumpkin stepping in as a teen mom herself and saying, "I'm going to take my sister." From you. Because she deserves better. And I'm taking her. Me and Josh. Just getting married. Just starting out. Have a baby of their own. Living in an apartment. I'm going to step in and take my sister. Make sure she don't get lost in the sauce. Right. I don't, I don't want to keep seeing myself in the glasses. <laughs> but. Then. Nobody's talking about her being on the mass Singer. And her and her mama was on there. But where's that money? Because I'm, I'm sure they get paid per episode that they make it to before they get unmasked. I'm sure they didn't get, I'm not, I want to say they didn't get unmasked the very first night. So if, I'll have to find out which, how far they got into the season. Because I want to say they did two, maybe three episodes. But I'll get back to you next by the time I edit this, I, you know how I do it. Put it up there. Put it up in the hair. <laughs> but she, she still need, should be having, she should at least have a lot more than 33000 The Dancing with the Stars. Seriously, where's that money? So you saying that 33000 is from Dancing with the Stars? Hmm. Okay. Okay. I didn't know. Let me go ahead and wipe my forehead off because I didn't know I had stupid stamps across my forehead. Okay. Gotcha. But anyway, this last episode, she was on her way to school. They made it to the townhouse that they, her and Draylon are sharing. Draylon is working. And he's working, he has to be up and on, I guess, at work by 6 a.m. Because he's saying he's always up at 5 a.m. Getting ready for work. So he's tired. He even dozed off sitting there talking to Pumpkin. Like, naughty. Like, I'm tired. He couldn't help it. And a lot of chuckling told him, like, just go upstairs and go to sleep. You know, and then when we get ready to go to dinner, we'll wake you up to go. He says, yeah, I probably won't go because I got to be up at 5. I'm tired. And this is how he looks. <laughs> Like, he been out drinking all day. <laughs> he just came in from a stupor. <laughs> dragging himself, literally dragging himself by his own collar. <laughs> up those stairs. But, hey. I give him respect. Because he was making sure. A lot of won't, a lot of gets. You know. I didn't think that this relationship was going to last as long as it's lasting. So, I'm proud of them. I'm proud of them. So, kudos to you. I tip my hat to them. You know, because I was a naysayer and they, they proved me a liar. <laughs> I, I admit it. You know, I can admit that to anybody. If I was wrong, I was wrong. I was wrong. But that's pretty much uh, it. Pumpkin did go down for parents weekend or whatever. And I'm glad she called Pumpkin. That's, that's her mama. Her sister mama. So, of course, I'm sitting in here by the window with the window open and <laughs> listening to the neighborhood go by because it's a school across the street, an elementary school. So, I'm sitting here tired myself, but I guess that's it for today and Mama June.
because I really think personally that Pumpkin and Alana is going to get their own shows. They're, they're going to eventually get over June. I'm over June right now. And that's only because Alana, Alana deserves the best. You know, why, why not help your child pay for school? You helped Jessica. Even if it was Jessica's money, you was giving her. And luckily, from what I heard, you know, what I heard and what I seen online, I don't know how much it's true, but Alana got um, over, well over $100,000 in another account from Pumpkin helping her, you know, and I, don't, and I don't think she can touch that money until she's 21. Just imagine the interest on that money. And if she's smart, like we hope she is, you know, smarter than June, we know that. We know that. Um, She won't touch it until she graduates from school. That way, she guaranteed to have, to have a nice nest egg to start her life. To start her life. And so, that's just my thoughts and my opinions. You know, and she doing something with herself. Why Pumpkin asked this child if she was pregnant? I almost fell out of my chair. Oh, I'm like, girl. This what we was trying to avoid. Alana was like, are you serious? No. She like, if she could have reached over there and slapped her sister. She like, nah, I'm good. And Pumpkin's like, well, y'all do live together. And I know y'all doing grown folks things in y'all house. And I just had to ask. She says, no, I would have told you. If that was the case. And she's like, no, I'm going to school. Baby is not on my list right now. Not even in, on the horizon anytime soon. So I, hopefully she continued to move down that path of, no, I'm good. So if nobody told you today that they love you, I love you. If, let me be the one to tell you you are somebody. You are smart. You are special. You are somebody. At least to me. So, look in that mirror. Hold your head up high. Put your shoulders a little further back. And say, thank you, God. I'm here today. And I am smart. And I am beautiful. And I am somebody. Anybody else say any different? Dust that off your shoulder and keep it moving. Put it back on their plate. Tell them that's, that's a demon you need to fight. Not me. We got enough on our plates. Put their shit. Sorry. I thought I was going to get through a video without cursing. I almost made it. Maybe the next video I'll get through it. But that's your, your, that's your meal. You keep that. That hatred over there. That hater, haterade. I'm going to need you to continue drinking that. Because I don't want none. So, like, comment, share. All the good things. Get, get this video out there for me. We growing, y'all. We steady growing. And we got to keep growing. We got to keep being happy. We got to keep being thick and fabulous. Because I am. Fat and thick. Fabulous and thick. F-A-T. Fabulous and thick. And I love every bitch of it. And I think y'all do too. <laughs> and I love y'all for it. So let me go ahead and get these glasses back on my regular glasses. And I found my debit card, y'all. It's just sitting here. Of course, I'm not going to show you the numbers. <laughs> I was looking for that earlier. Anyway, like, comment, share. Appreciate y'all. Have a good one. Bye.